I run a stand-up paddleboarding business right outside of Washington, D.C., and I wanted to share with you what we've learned about inflatable paddleboards. Whether you're looking for a paddleboard for yourself or you're running a SUP business, we hope you find this information helpful. Several years ago, our fleet consisted entirely of epoxy and foam fiberglass boards. While these boards were some of the most durable on the market, they scratched, dinged, we had problems with fins and fin boxes breaking. We also tried some of the first generation inflatables, but at that time, they were not very stable for anybody who's over 140 pounds, and we had problems with holes and durability. As inflatable design progressed, we transitioned to have our entire fleet be inflatable paddle boards, and we used a variety of sizes and brands. After a full season of using these boards, two brands stood out, Red Paddle Co. and Earth River Sup. Most of our paddlers are first timers and they love the stable platform that the Earth River and Red Paddle provide them. Our SUP yoga instructors and students love the stable platform, multiple anchor points. While these boards are great for first timers, they also are high quality enough and their design are fantastic as a paddler progresses to the intermediate level skills. This year, we're featuring only these two brands, Earth River and Red Paddle. And one of the main reasons why we're using these is because of the permanent glued on durable fins. These fins are bulletproof. Last year, we didn't have any problems with them breaking, cracking, or delaminating. In fact, they're so durable that you can sit here and stand on it, bounce on it, no damage to the fin. You couldn't do that with any other paddle board. Another thing we like about these boards is the durable, high quality construction. I know you can't see it on the video, but there's a clear difference between these boards and the other boards that we see on the water. Last year, we patched nearly every other brand that we had, except for the Earth River and the Red Paddle. In fact, the Earth River brand is created by a whitewater SUP expert and built to withstand strong currents and rocky shores and light enough so you can scramble over rocks and get to the whitewater. We have another unique aspect about our business. We store all of our boards in this trailer, inflated, all summer long. In the middle of the summer, it gets boiling in this trailer. And we experience some problems with other brands, deck pads coming off and the boards becoming delaminated. We didn't experience any problems with the Red or Earth River brands. We sell all of our boards at the end of each season, and these brands always sell first and they're favorite of our customers all summer long. We know that there's lower cost alternatives out there, but we hope you see the difference in value, and we definitely see the difference in investing a little bit more to have a higher quality product. 